Welcome back. It's me. It's me again. I'm, it's Dom. I'm Dom. I'm Dom. Put this on the behind the scenes. Behind the berry. Welcome back. It's your boy Dom, local stylist, vintage creator out of Columbus. Today I want to show you some of my favorite non-traditional ways to style a blazer. Back in business school, I had to wear blazers a lot, which I found them very stuffy. And more recently, I've been kind of wearing them in a non-traditional way. And people traditionally wear these either to work or to a more formal event. But you could definitely style a blazer in a more casual way. They're a really great layering piece, and a lot of people don't look to them when they're just a normal jacket. For this first look, I went with the Will's Stretch Wool Blazer and Heather Bourbon. Paired it with a Huckberry Outfitters t-shirt, the Rhodes Roper boot, a pair of boot cut jeans, and this double RL hat that has this kind of faded patina look to it. Kind of wanted to give a urban cowboy look. I really like this look of cowboy boots, but in a less traditional setting, which is the same thing with this blazer. I thought the t-shirt kept it super casual, and the red hat really offset the more neutral tones of the outfit. I could see myself wearing this out night around town, grabbing a few drinks with friends. It's a super simple outfit, and I think the blazer elevates it just enough. For look number two, I went with the Wills blazer in Heather Gray. Paired it with the Gitman Vintage Oxford. I really like the cream and blue colorway of this. A nice light wash pair of denim. The Yucatan Chucka boots. The spring inspired tie. And this cream white hat that I really thought was a cherry on top. And while it looks more traditional, I really thought that the juxtaposition between the blazer and the jeans and the chucka boots really set the look off. You got the more traditional blazer, tie, Oxford up top, a nice casual pair of denim, and a shoe that's kind of a statement piece in and of itself. And then the chain stitching on the hat really tied all the different colors I was wearing all together. I probably wear this as something like a date night with the wife, or if I wanted to flex on some coworkers at the happy hour, this is the best outfit to do it in. And last, I went with this Wills blazer in navy. I paired it with this Taylor Stitch Rugby. I really like the stripe pattern on this. A pair of light wash denim, the Cordor case Swiss, and these lavender socks that add just a little bit of pop of color. And this On The Road hat by Ample. I was inspired by a picture I saw myself in middle school recently. I really love to wear Ralph Lauren and pop my collar, so today I decided why not try that look with a blazer, and it worked out. Cuff the pants, show the lavender socks, the little peek through, and just some white sneakers to keep it super casual. And overall, this was just a really fun prep school inspired look. And for an undershirt under the blazer, it doesn't always have to either be a t-shirt on the casual side or an Oxford on the more dressed up side. You can play with your collars. I really like the way this rugby looked under this blazer. This is the kind of look I'd wear when I'm feeling myself. I'm on a body of water, listening to some yacht rock. I might have one or two daiquiris in my hand. I'm taking my hat off, putting the captain hat on, and we're in for a great night. And if you're asking yourself, would I look good in a blazer? You probably would. You gotta take risks and chances when it comes to styling and getting yourself dressed every day. Have fun and give it a shot. Thanks again for tuning in. I'm Dom. You can catch me on my socials on TikTok at Dapper Dom, Dominique Sean Jones on Instagram. And until next time, I'll see you out there.